Hi there Capricorns, this is Astro Girl and thanks so much for tuning in for the week May 19 through 25. And it really is an interesting time to be born under the sign of Capricorn. There's a lot of fire and air energy around, meaning that you're going, you may feel a little flustered, you may feel as if you're being bossed around, you may feel as if people are flighty and at work the fire and air signs are skipping out early or taking longer lunches or you know acting up generally because they Mars has moved direct finally this week and Mars moves direct in Libra which is the sign of harmony balance and you know I think that where everyone's going to say enough work let's go outside let's go on a field trip let's go to a restaurant for lunch and take an extra hour and whether or not that's something that you'll be down for you might be the boss and not be happy about that or you might be right along with them it just depends but it's definitely going to be a very social time and a time when you will feel very uh, you know that you need to be very spontaneous that people aren't waiting around for you that you're either with them or it's not happening and that's something I think you need to remember as well. You don't want to get left behind Capricorns because it could be, you know, a really big thing that they're planning and, you know, you miss out on it. There's nothing much really happening in the, in the earth and water signs at all. We have Jupiter in Cancer, which is continuing to bring you good luck in your communication zone. So if you have been communicating with someone, whether about a job, whether about a first date and it's taking forever, whether about a transfer overseas, whether about a flatmate, keep on with the communication. It's a really good time for you to be communicating and you have good luck with communicating. You're, you're writing the right thing. And I find that people who are looking for flatmates and stuff have a lot of trouble because they, you know, pick the wrong people. They don't read through everything or they don't put the right stuff in there classified. And if that's something you're trying to do this week, really, you know, you've got to be really, really specific. It's like when you're looking for a partner, you've got to be very specific about what sort of person you want living with you. It's like a job application. So remember that this weekend. Have a great week. Great speaking to you. And I look forward to speaking to you again next week.